Success! Oh, hi. Glad you're here. I'm glad to be with you. Uh, this, this, this set, I always, I always will get one of, one of these. Um, this is like, I don't know, the second or third iteration of this particular vehicle. Uh, but me personally, this is one of my favorite Star Wars vehicles in general. Like, the Clone Wars era has most of my favorite vehicles. And this one is probably one of, if not the, like, my favorite vehicle of that, of that era. I love this tank. It re it, it's really nostalgic and reminiscent. It, it always takes me back to uh, uh, a couple of games. The 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 um, episode two game, Clone Wars, and the original, maybe first or second, maybe both of uh, Battlefront. I just would love driving this tank and shooting people up, and it would hover, and you know you, you could get in a lot of places with it, and. It's just an awesome vehicle. I love the design. I love the look. I love the colors. I love the the the. I love everything about it. It's one of my favorite vehicles. So anytime Lego makes this tank, I I I have at least one other one. I will uh, I will get it. So this is the newest one. But what's awesome about this one is it's not just you know a new version of the of of the of the hover tank, but it's got some of the best minifigs, like ever, like. Well, I mean, definitely that have come with this particular vehicle. So the minifigs really is is what is what sells this thing. It's kind of like the tank is the bonus for me. But the interesting thing, I was looking for a different other set, and I was going to go to my Target, which was you know it's 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 a little ways. I don't have a car. I I scoot around, and. Uh, Rather than just go to Target, I looked up their website, and I could check my local Target to see what Lego sets it had in stock. And I can, my personal experience, I can attest to specifically Lego at my particular Target. It was extremely accurate. Their website told me it didn't have the one set I was looking for, but then it told me uh, it did have this set. So I went straight to Target, and sure enough, absolutely accurate. Didn't have the one set I was looking for. But they had a ton of these sets. And when I discovered that this set is currently unavailable, sold out, on lego.com. Well, there you go then. So I was like, well, I'm going to snag this then. Because it's available down the street, but not available on Lego's website. So, if that's the, the case with Target, good on them. I would recommend, you know, check, check, check on their websites if you don't feel like going down there all the time. And they should be accurate as to what Lego sets they might have. And occasionally they'll have Lego sets that are unavailable on Lego.com. Anywho, this is uh, a really cool, really fun set. Uh, it's this. It's it, it's an awesome tank. Opens up here. Ah. And it's got the wheels, of course. Got to have the wheels. You got to be careful. It'll roll right off your table. Uh, these both move and shoot. Pew, pew, pew. So that's, you know, that's cool. And then you've got the, the gunner up here. And this, ah, ah, that opens as well. Yes. Very nice and enjoyable build. Not not too engaging, but, you know, fun enough. And lots of lots of playability, though. And definitely some displayability. It's got a nice little, little, little area there for the guy to stand in. You can close. Ooh, yes. But like I said, the minifigs. This one in particular, I think, is the best. Because this is a unique helmet. One of my favorite helmets, and I believe it's only come in the past a couple of times, and I only have one in, like, orange, I think? But this guy is radical. I mean, look at the design of this minifig, especially his helmet. The molding on that helmet is absolutely fantastic. And the coloring. My goodness the coloring it's purple see because the because the thing is is this is what do they call it it's uh it's the 187th the 187th legion we got a commander and two troopers so these are like these are mace windu's guys these are mace windu's guys all right i don't think we've ever gotten Mace Windu's guys before. 
So they're purple. He's like, yo, man, purple's my favorite color, and I'm going to have a purple lightsaber, and my troopers are going to have purple uniforms. So we got these. I put the second trooper is a placeholder on my purple astronaut spaceman rainbow. That's filling in nicely, actually. Anyway, so this is the other regular trooper. Another great. We got the we got the uh, phase one clone helmet, I believe. Is what it's called? No, that's not phase one. This is more phase two. So this would be later in the Clone Wars, closer to episode three. Yeah, because these are the these are the later versions of the clone helmets, not the first ones. It's so like in the middle, something phase two. I don't know. I'm not as nerdy on Star Wars as I used to be, but. Uh, Look at this. I mean, look at this. The printing is, 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 is fantastic. These helmets. Oh, my gosh. Yes, please. With the color. They're purple. Did I mention that they're purple? They're purple. They're purple. They're purple troopers. They're purple. How awesome is that? So this set is worth it right there. I think the, 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 the well, yeah, definitely some Star Wars tax. Only 262 pieces, and it's $40. So you're definitely paying a little extra. But it's worth it for these minifigs. I'd say it's I'd say it's a decent forty dollars set. I don't feel like I got ripped off. Looks like you know, little little windows in there. So it's a great set. I really dig it. And then you got Mace Windu. I I'm I, I don't know for a fact, but I'm pretty sure they've only done Mace Windu like one or two times. There was the one with the light up lightsaber. There's been one in giant, really expensive sets. With a like giant clone tank or whatever the heck it was, the you know, the only the only Star Wars vehicle that has wheels, and uh, and the only Mace Windu that I have is the one that came with the Palpatine's arrest set. So this is like my second ever Mace Windu, and not only is it a new Mace Windu, a new Windu, Windu. I don't, anyway, uh, it's it look 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 at this. He's got little bits of the clone armor. Look at his arm printing. Amazing. It's got the Jedi logo on there. In in spoiler alert. Purple. Yeah, he's ready to go. He's got a little. I mean, I mean, I mean come on. Look at these arm printings. He's wearing little bits of clone trooper armor. It's very reminiscent of the Clone Wars micro series where he just wiped... Well, I don't think he was wearing any armor in that. But anyway, he's it's Mace Windu with, 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 with Clone Trooper armor bits. Absolutely fantastic minifig. I'm not surprised that this is sold out on Lego.com. But it might be available at your local Target. But this... I mean, I, I mean, I mean, right here. And it came with two of these guys. But right here... You get one of these guys, you get a Mace Windu, and you get two of these guys. So three purple troopers, one with a really cool helmet, and a and a fancy schmancy Mace Windu with, with trooper armor bits. That's worth the 40 bucks right there. I would, in a heartbeat, pay $10 for each one of these minifigs. Which is probably at least what they are at uh, your local Bricks and Minifigs. Who knows? I'll have to check that out sometime. So I'm very, 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 very happy... To have purchased. Oh yeah, you also get two battle droids. Yeah, who cares? Whatever. I got plenty of these, and but they're definitely that their arms and leg pieces are a lot sturdier. They would break off a lot, but they're a lot stronger than they used to be. And the set does give you an extra of each arm, both the straight one and the curved one. Uh, my son built this one, so he got the chest backwards and the head's not straight, but that's fine by me. I'm leaving it so that I know. Which one he built. I'm a very sentimental guy. Love my son to bits. So this, yeah, absolutely fantastic set. I would say absolutely worth $40 because I would, like I said, pay $40 for just those four minifigs. Plus you get two battle droids. Plus you get this tank! So, they're, they're purple. They're purple. I mean, come on. Who doesn't love purple? The only thing better than that is if I had some, some pink troopers. Give me some pink troopers. Wouldn't that be dope? Let's get every color of the rainbow on clone troopers. That would be something. Anywho, great set, great displayability, great playability, great value. I mean, look at these minifigs. Have I mentioned that I'm all about the minifigs? I'm a minifig guy? And, I, and in addition to that, I love collecting as many troopers from Star Wars as I can. Any different type, specific, especially, I guess I should say, especially different helmets. If it's a new helmet mold, I'm trying to get every single one there is. There's only like one or two that I don't have. 
but these are brand new troopers and technically a brand new helmet because it's purple but this mold is only like i said I, i've said all these things i'm repeating myself but anybody why wouldn't i look at this look at that look at that look at that purple okie dokie